Hello, everybody, and Merry Christmas. Hope you guys have had just a wonderful Christmas uh, past couple of days uh, and just really enjoying time with your family and friends and, and really just celebrating what Christmas is all about, and that's the birth of our Savior, Jesus. So just wanted to take just a minute today uh, as everybody's kind of wrapping up the the Christmas season, and, you know, we've all talked this week about being a giver, uh, and, you know, ultimately God gave the gift uh, of salvation through his son, Jesus Christ. And so one thing that comes to mind today, you know, we all have gone through the the motions this year of what gifts are we going to get, right? What gifts are we going to give? And we talked about on Sunday in TJ's message about how it's uh, more of a blessing to give than to receive. And that was the words of Jesus himself. And so one thing I want to to remind us of as we, you know, on this Christmas day um, is that, you know, that gift is not only today or Christmas Eve or this time of year. That gift that God gave uh, through his son, Jesus being born uh, of a virgin birth, coming to be born in a manger, um, and, and that whole scenario that God created as a part of his plan, that's not just one time a year. Um, it's actually available every single moment. And so it's it's literally the gift that keeps on giving. It's always there. It's always being offered. It's always ready to be received. You know, we all love receiving gifts. Um, it's great to give gifts, but there's something about receiving gifts. Well, that gift is ready to be received all the time. Uh, so, you know, if you've never received the gift of salvation through faith in Jesus Christ, God's Son, you know, there's no better time than now, this Christmas day. So um, I just want to read one, two of my favorite verses uh, in, in all of Scripture. Uh, it's actually Lamentations 3, 22 and 23. It says, um, Through the Lord's mercies we are not consumed, because his compassions fail not. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. You know, you think about every single day is a new start, right? The, the sun comes up fresh and new every morning. That is God's mercies. That is God's gift. That is the opportunity to receive Jesus Christ as your Savior. It's new with every single day. It's new with every single moment. It's always there. It's always available. It's always ready to be accepted and received and taken in to your heart. So I want us to not think or be misled that the only time of year that it's about Jesus is Christmas. It's not. It's a time that we really make an effort to celebrate him and celebrate his birth. But every single day can be Christmas, right? Every single day should be Christmas. And we should constantly be celebrating the birth of Christ because it's through him that we have salvation. It's through him and only him. It's the one and only way uh, to, to eternal salvation. You know, the pastor said one thing. He wrapped up his message on Sunday with three Ps, and I want to mention those. Um, it was it was the package that God gave through his son, through the birth of Jesus in the manger. And that was the gift that came as a baby right through Mary. And then there was the portrait as Jesus went through his life of the cross. And what does the cross mean to us? It means that Jesus died for us to wipe away our sin, uh, to remove our past so that we know that we have our hope in him and that he took our place on the cross, the portrait of what the cross means. And then there was also the part of the promise, the promise, and that was his resurrection when he raised up out of the grave and he went and ascended into heaven to provide a place for us. That's the promise we have when we understand the package the gift that's there for us to receive. We understand the portrait of what he did on the cross and that he, he's our salvation because he took our place on the cross and then the promise of an eternity with him in heaven. Great things for us to reflect on today, not only today at Christmas, but every day. So let's do that. Let's remember that that gift is available year round. Uh, I hope that you've accepted that gift and that Jesus is your savior this year. And if so, that's amazing. If not, do it today. Uh, Merry Christmas, everybody. We love you and uh, hope to see you soon.